Alright, and we are back. Another episode. Uh, Xanth is off somewhere up here dealing with this guy. I'm not entirely sure. What, he's like boring into the lava or something? That's the plan. Oh, you're gonna walk over the lava and just kind of worm into it? Yep. That might result in your death. Ah, oh, I fell down. Reload. You knocked me down for two fucking turns. Probably save after this cooldown comes off cooldown, so I don't have to wait for it every time uh, we have okay. to reload. I'll let you know. Okay. Okay. Alright, go ahead and save. We're saving. Alright, you're good. Basically, I was trying to uh, I spotted something. wait to activate my ability to where I can walk on any surface. One step, slip, walk another step, slip, walk another step, slip.
de aggroed. This is ridiculous. There just has to be this fucking statue here. I'm just gonna fucking teleport this stupid statue way the fuck. Because this statue's bothering the shit out of me. It keeps freezing me. Oh, that's cool, and I can't teleport it away. Apparently it's an invalid target. Can I destroy it? Oh, it has a hundred percent piercing resistance. Which means I have to damage it with other fucking means. Hmm. Well, at least you can destroy it. One shot, mate. Reload. 
Side note, they're not. He isn't immune to knockdown. No, he isn't. He has a 96 percent or 97 percent chance to resist it. God, this is just fucking stupid. At this point, I don't even care if I die. As long as I get him into this fucking lava. Oh look, he died. Huh. And he didn't even die. You might want to get out of there. Huh. That is definitely one way to do that. Did you get experience? Uh, yeah, I mean, Jahan leveled up. Okay, good. Save. Great. That was seriously pain in the ass. <laughs> uh. All right, I sent the item to drop. All right. Let's. See. And yeah, the lava just straight one shot him. Also, Jahan now has five skill points, which means I can get a rank three in one of these, which just means I get an additional novice and a depth spell. Um, I don't, I'm assuming that uh, the master spells don't come until level five. So, keep in mind when you have a level four or a level five in those abilities or weapon or whatever. Yeah, you get, you get Yeah, you get an extra one of those in connection to the points. Also, I believe around level 12 is when we can start using Master Spells, which is what you just hit. So it might not be a bad idea to start trying to go for a rank 5 in one of those uh, mage trees or whatever. Mage skills. No shame. No shame. It's a good thing my head's in the way. <laughs> Kinda. <laughs> um. What do I really want to spec him into, though? That's the question. Because, I mean, all these spells are already really useful. And there's still a lot more that I can teach him, because he can have... I spec them more into witchcraft? I mean, it seems like that may end up being useful. Because, I mean, there's spells that, like, lower resists, there's debuffs, then he has the, the crazy buff here, Oath of Desecration. See, so, yeah, I'm thinking I should go witchcraft. Witchcraft isn't bad. Yeah, witchcraft. Oh, okay, so at rank 4, he gets his first master spell. So it's rank 4 that you get master stuff. Oh, okay. See, so, yeah, I'm going to save this just for the points. Not a bad one. The 
this helmet has plus one to perception and plus one to leadership of full armor. Mm. If I got an extra leadership, all it's gonna do is give y'all additional armor, and I feel like armor is completely fucking useless. times on this one little patch of ice. skill and I just want to you know let it auto basically and he still won the argument basically um, he's saying that he can will the weather away but he's gonna charge me 2,000 gold to do it so I tried doing the reason thing to basically get it done for free and it failed probably because it's not a thing you actually would be able to do I mean think about it if he could what if he could read or whatever the weather away that would kind of almost defeat the whole purpose of killing the fucking guy that created the weather to begin with
Also, looking at this little stupid puzzly thing we have to do right here, I feel like it would be impossible to do it without one of these spells that allows you to walk on top of the ground effects. Yeah. Because I suspect that the, um, the lever that I'm about to pull by teleporting you across is going to unlock the gate past the lava that doesn't disappear. That just missed miserably. But then the lava is not, you know, going to disappear, and there's, well, only a couple ways to walk over it. Yeah, because on this side there's a chest. Also, the, those uh, doors you look at, you can't hurt them and lock level 99. Yeah. So, how do we. Okay. Um, don't go any closer. I can walk through fire and ice. Uh, let me uh, heal you right quick, just in case. Oh, oh. oh that fucking cloud is causing a problem. Hold oh, no, up, let me grab one breath. Because he can disarm it. Eee, smoke be gone. Teleport me to the other side. Also, there's a mine in front of you. Don't walk forward. Also, your teleport doesn't do 200 damage, right? I don't think so. No, 115 to 140. Okay. Target is out of sight. Well, use the magical unlock then. Should I? You can make more. Well, let me do this just in case. I'm glad I saved. Magical unlock do, doesn't do anything. So how the fuck do you get past that? I do not know. Teleport me back over the lava. I do have a thought. There is a switch. Oh yeah, there is. What if I were to teleport this douchebag on top of the switch? You can try it. Here, uh, let me uh. You can do it. Yeah, I can do it. Alright, he does it. Does it. Maybe one of us has to walk on top of it. Yeah, well, I can do that at least. How could that happen? If I can get Wolgriff in there, I could get this whole thing disarmed. 
Okay, well, there is a click. That is a strange sort of pit. There must be a way to disarm it. You've got a, a lock disarmer container on you, right? On somebody? On uh, Wolverine, yeah. If you send me it, I can walk out, out there and disarm that, probably. That just consumed it. I mean, check your inventory, see if it's still there. No. Yeah, that was the only one that I had. Um, I guess we can take a quick trip. And let's see, if I'm not mistaken, there's a, uh, And there's a way shrine relatively close to this, so we can uh, just teleport to a town, pick up some Trappist Arm Kits, maybe some more lockpicks as well. I think that's going to be our best choice. What there do you think? Are two, four. There are four of them in this area. Alright. Uh, we will go here. The only thing, though, is it's still the same thing on the other side. So you get two gates, but there's a chest behind it. And I feel like there's no way we're going to be able to get to the chest without first pulling the lever on the other side. Which, in that case, it wouldn't really matter if we disarmed the traps or not, because we're not going to be able to get past the gate. Well, hold up, because there's that thing that you stood on that went click. I have a sneaking suspicion that there's another one of those on the other side. And the nice thing about the party members is I can leave them in place. Possibly. So I'm gonna go. Here. Yeah, I'm desperate to sell stuff, so I mean, I might as well do that. Yeah, just go ahead and start talking to people, sell stuff. See if I can uh, get a couple of trap disarm kits. Is there a spell that disarms traps? Not that I know of. Yeah. bow or crossbow, Jesus. Doesn't have crit chance. Holy balls, it hits hard. these two explosive arrowheads, or, or bleh, static cloud arrowheads. Alright. Alright, so I have ten dis disarm kits. Um, I also picked up a skill book for uh, Jahan. I picked up a lower resistance skill book. So that might be useful. It actually might be very useful. And now I can sell the rest of the stuff to this lady. To I can sell some her. stuff anyway. You are quickly becoming my favorite customer. I just picked up ten of them, babe. Okay. Alright. I think I just 
drained this Fletcher completely dry and cold. Okay. Well, I cleared out a lot of junk in my inventory. Still have some stuff. I'm sending you stuff. Okay, cool. Wait, could you not sell that enlightened amulet? Uh, it's a quest item. So, remember that huge wheel that I found? Uh, yeah. I dropped it in the middle of the, the little town area by the Fletcher. Okay. So, if we end up needing it, we know where it is. That'll work. What if I just get a message strength on high enough and just walking? Did you that would be. That would be because of me. I'm trying to uh, make an item. Making an item takes strength? Because I have to uh, equip several different things to be able to get the strength required to equip a piece of gear that gives me the crafting skill required to... Yeah, y you see where this is going. Yes, I do. Second town. Oh, um, Did that's. Sell a forest, Silver Glen. Um, yeah, it's Silver Glen. I just don't uh, remember well, specifically. Let me go there without you anyway. Mm. I was just curious if I could like look to see if I could find like level twelve um, crossbow. Because I mean, this bitch has a level twelve crossbow, but it has no crit rate. I didn't even check to see how much it costs, but I don't think gold is really much of an issue at the moment. No, I have 8,075 on me, and I still have more stuff to sell. Yeah, we have 20,000 gold then. Nice! Let's make sure I read this. Alright, well now we have some trap disarm kits. So hopefully, that means that we can, uh... Also, can we please just waste that scroll on this? What? Look in your inventory. That thing weighs 14 fucking pounds. I've been lugging it around for a while. Oh, I didn't know you still had it. And this one's uh, magically locked? No, it's just locked. But look at the requirement to unlock it. Mm, okay. But I mean, it is an ornate. You want to come give me luck, pup? Actually, I mean, I, let me see if we can unlock first. Works just like a charm. And it can't be picked. Can you not magically unlock it? Apparently, I just used the scroll. Okay, so it only works on magical locks. Got it. Literally, magical locks only. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna drop this thing like near the Fletcher or something. And I mean, right now it's right right up here by this well. <laughs> uh, I wanted to buy a way shrine. Or at least by a town, or somewhere we'll remember where it is. So I have no idea if those chests, like, scale to level or how they work. I mean, if we carry it around forever, it will open up and find something that demands getting, like, level 8 shit, you know? Well, I sent it back to you so you can kind of place it wherever. Just stick it right next to this wave shrine, I guess. It is a much bigger chest. Holy crap. Yeah, that's a big chest. Jeez. Alright. 
Uh, go to the second town really quick. I want to check to see if they have a level 12 crossbow for sale. So I'm about to hit level 12. I really want one with crit chance. It's just none of the ones I've seen so far have it. Out of the worlds, you venture into the embrace of immaculates. Salutations! In the town or out of the town? This is in the town. Okay, it's in the town. Alright, so which is the dude that sells, um... That's the church. Hey, look, it's Alfie. Hey, there. Oh. Lovely to see that you. That dude again. that we saved? Is it Alfie? Swear. Oh, he's has good. some crazy shit in his stuff. Really? Dude has 6,500 gold for one. Let's see. One, two, three. Four. He has five blue weapons, two purple, or one purple helmet, one blue helmet, one purple body, uh, two blue bodies, one blue boots. We left one... none of that, you hear? Oh. What? That this is not your forge! Best. Apparently it is now. Let's see. Oh my god. Um. Farron, this guy has a ring that quote unquote inflict stun on contact. Huh. I wonder if you have to like melee for that to work. Most likely. He has a um. a leather uh. Brigandine plate body or whatever with plus one to wand, plus one to initiative, and plus point seven to movement. A helmet that gives 40 HP and one armor specialist. The bow is not really that great. He has an air staff with plus one to leadership with 61 to 121 air damage. But he has a ton of gold. Also, I have 628 health now. <laughs> that water staff that you found, I just equipped it. Jesus. That doesn't even feel fair. Like, I lost 50% constitution, right? But you have triple my health. I'm sorry, you have over triple so my health. To drop by I don't even have 200. Doing grandly your night shift. Thanks to your valiant rescue of Alfie, she's alive and kicking, my liege. That doesn't Just like seem I have a song in my heart and a spring in my step, my liege. I've had orcs on my tail and bandaged It's supposed to be a 60% reduction, not a 70%. Or a 50%, not a Selling the rest of this stuff. Woo, I have 10,000 gold. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. This earth stick has a 7% crit rate on it. 58 to 116 earth damage. Oh, huh? Hello again, or do a salutoy, as we say in our homeland. I told you you'd be. Please, Mara. Must you bother me at every turn? Do you have a deadly spore scroll? I think I do. Oh, you're a good boy, aren't you, Alfie? Bandit slayer of mine. Oh, yes, you are. Yes, you are. I can see turning that into a skill book when you're bad. Also, why does this dude still have stuff I can steal? Questions. Remember to take a break now and again, Bjorn. You know what the doctor said. Please, Mark. Must you bother me at every turn?
Well, there. I just made a tornado skill book, so there's that. Now I have 12,241 gold. I made another, like, 800 from stealing that guy's shit. Hmm. Oh, I missed something. Whatever. Well, I can't get the shield for some reason. It wants me to walk around the outside. Take a break now and again. He's down. Oh. Stay still. Wee. <laughs> That's tornado. Hmm. Remove surfaces from the battlefield. Reveals invisible characters and clears warm, burning, and haste. Shit. Huh. I wonder... Huh. Where are the shops around here? Well, it really wasn't much. It was just that blacksmith, mostly. Isn't this guy a shop? I think he has some stuff, but... Oh, well, there's one of the crossbows I want, but not quite what I want. Look at the crossbow he has. They've got level uh, 12 variants of that. Hmm. That's a level 10 variant. I wonder if this hooker has anything new. Hi there, cutie pie. Wanna have a good time? Nope, just a ton of gold in the bar of soap. <laughs> that world weary Yes, the hookers all have bars of soap. I find that strange. Not to tear a lot of... Oh, here we go. We want the move here, kids. What game? Whoa! Going? Goddess greetings, friend. Her greatness gave us fire, her greatness gave us earth, and my savvy brings you spells at the best rate in town. Come, give me your best offer. I just spent 3600 gold on a thing. <laughs> like, just, just, just look at this. Sent to you. Oh, that is beautiful. That's the first one with, a, with skills that I've seen. Where the wind blows, the goddess breathes. Where the rivers run, the goddess weeps. How can I connect you to our eternal goddess, my friend? Also, feel free to put that on somebody. Come on, that bell right there might be really good. What did it have on it? Uh, it's plus one lock picking, plus one body building. Well, what was the other belt? Was... Okay, yeah, I mean that would be a that would definitely be an upgrade for uh, for Wolgriff. I think I'll uh, get that for him. What was the other belt? Uh, plus one lock picking, 13 poison resist, and plus one blacksmithing, 17 poison resist. Oh my god! Huh? This dude has a level 18 bow. Damn! It would cost me 11 action points to shoot with it once. <laughs> because of the level difference. It does 88 to 152 piercing damage. That's a bow. Huh. So that's what those are gonna look like closer to endgame. You believe in the gods, baby? 
Because you're the answer to all my But yeah, I did want to look at that other belt. So I think he had one with it was either like initiative or dexterity or something on it. I didn't see that. Because I just realized my belt was crap. Come here, sweetheart. Or if I had a star for every time you write my name, I'd have a gallop. Hi there, cutie pie. Want to have a good time? Come hither, sweetheart. If I said you had a great body, would you hold it against me? Oh yeah, this guy has the Deadly Spore skill book. Actually, my... Hold up. He also has the Immolation skill book. Those are both master spells. Okay, so I only have. I can actually pick Goddess that up. Greeting, friend. Her greatness gave us fire. Her greatness gave us earth. And my savvy brings you spells at the best rate in town. Oh, Deadly Come, Sprite, the master rank up. spell. I can't actually learn that yet. I'll be able to soon, but I can't right now. Okay, um, let's go ahead and see if we can figure this thing out. these do anything? There's three of them. You're too far away for me to... Okay, these. You see these switches? Now they're here. Don't actually put Wolgraph over there. I'll get on the other one that you can't see the city. Or I can just slip and fall. That works too. Alright. Oh. Ah. Alright, I'm just activating this fucking shit. Because, like, I'm, I take one step and bust my ass. Knock down. Step disturbs no terrain. Alright, you want all the little switches? I, I can't individually space them out. You wait really quickly. Um, give me a second. Let me try and do this maybe. Oh can, you, can you not switch to uh, the Jahan? Switching to Jahan wouldn't it wouldn't do anything because okay, you see how there's a chain between 
uh, Jahan and Wolnerf, that's the issue. So they're walking in tandem, and I cannot separate them. It will not let me. Oh, wait. I stand corrected. Okay, so we're all on one. That turned off the lava. Huh. I think. Alright, let me, uh... Oh, I see what we need to do. What? Oh, turn the lava's back. Turn the lava's back? Yeah. That's fine. Okay, this ice is irritating me. The wall grip, stand back up, dude. Fine, I, don't, I don't need the lava to be gone. Yeah, that, that's it, it would make it would make it easier for the lava to be gone. It's not the thing I was trying to hit. Okay, so all right, I'm gonna step on this thingy. I think this is the one that makes the lava go away. Yes. Okay, walk over there and teleport that statue away. There is a switch behind the statue or a lever on the wall behind the statue. All right. Just be careful. It is a watcher statue. I don't know what it's going to do. I recommend saving if you don't feel like wasting scrolls. Alright, so where am I teleporting this thing to? Just go away. Okay, so one lava came back. Yeah, it saw you and spewed out lava. So just teleport it. So, like, I'd probably teleport to that bush in the same area by the, the locked gate. Just so you can get behind it, or I can get behind it and pull that fucking lever. Chaos grips my hands today. Alright, cool. Now you can just walk out of that area. Well, I'm curious to test something. I was hoping. Wait, hold up. What? There's one more thing I want to test right quick. There's one more thing I want to test. Does this do anything? Nope. <laughs> what was your fire resistance? I don't know. Apparently not high enough. <laughs> I feel like you'd have to have 100% for that to work. Uh, that's funny. Well, I already have 10 fire resist with uh, Avatar of Fire. I think it goes up to what, 35%? Yeah. Yeah, walk out of that area. If you don't want to die. And I am out. You want the lava come back? Yes. Okay, so I get rid of the thing on that side. Who's by thing? You mean the gate? Uh, yes. Nice. On this level, we'll most likely get rid of the gate on this side. Intruder spotted. And it did! Beautiful! It is really nice to be able to walk on top of lava. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna get rid of these fucking things. Nice, right, so there's just, I mean, just walk over it, grab yeah, the chest. Fuck it, I can just grab the chest. I'm still stuck waiting for my cooldown, though. To your bones, yet you're walking on top of lava. Not touch the chest. There it goes. Oh, I can't pick it up. Enough time to get back. 
that hastening made the difference. Okay, so there wasn't actually loot in that chest. You picked up something called a Royal Guard Talisman. I'm pretty sure that's a quest item. Hmm. Okay. It gives all of the resistances. I sent right. it to you. But yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a thing going to be needed to open a door, kind of like in that first area. Yeah, probably. All right. So now that we figured out this little puzzle over here, I'm going to go ahead and cut this episode off. It's been about an hour, and we'll see you in the next one.